It's the end of the day with Ray. Hello, my friends. Well, we got a new competitor in the Document Imaging Channel. Folks, this competitor's big, powerful corporation. They're starting out in Europe. And they're going to work across the land. And pretty soon they'll be in your customer's office taking away your great relationship. Folks, you know what? I'm sitting there online yesterday. I find this article out of Europe. And it's just amazing to me what I'm seeing. So without any further ado, I want to get on my Sharp Interactive Board. And the first thing I do is I want to pull up a slide here. And, and, and let's just read this together, my friends. The data giveaway is gaining momentum. Soon resellers and dealers will be screaming, where's my customer? Where's my customer? I was given access to these huge corporations customer information, and then I lost my customer. I don't know how this happened. Dealers and resellers, please wake up to the realities all around you, will you? It starts out with HP Amplify, you know? Nobody likes it, you know? I did a poll, by the way. I talked to some dealers of all the OEMs that you work with. Which one are you, you know, the least happy with? Which one don't you trust the most, you know? And you know HP won that contest, by the way. But here I am, uh, um, I'm online and I pull up, let me just pull up the article. E Channel News, Tech Data launches open MPS platform. Tech Data has a DCA tool. They call it Open MPS. You read the article. What's, what's amazing about these DCA tools, folks? You know, when, when people like Tech Data to say, hey, we're going to be in the MPS business. We're going to fill up your customers' printers and with toner and ink, and we'll help you do it because you don't do it as good as us, and we're going to help you do all this. But keep in mind, we're getting all your customer information while, you're, while we're helping you do it. Oh, it's crazy stuff, folks. But, but I'm reading this thing, and it's all about toner replenishment. These DCA tools, some of them are pretty complicated, right? Some of them do some pretty neat stuff. Some of them can help with preventative maintenance, do all this other stuff. Of course, they don't mention all this other stuff in this article. They just talk about putting toner in printers and ink in printers. I, I don't know what this obsession is. The whole world thinks everybody's running out of toner every 10 minutes. You know, if we don't get that toner in there two days before it runs out, that office, pro people probably start killing each other. They'll be out of toner. They'll be out of ink. The world will end. <laughs> probably not. Folks, we, we got to really pay attention to who we're allowing access to our customers. I mean, what would be the purpose that any dealer or reseller would allow a giant corporation like Tech Data, who, by the way, owns Cinex as well, right? This huge corporation have access to your end users so your end users don't run out of toner because you're not smart enough to figure out how to use a DCA tool yourself. Or maybe it's because you're trying to save like a half a cent per serial number. You know, Tech Data says, hey, if you use that same tool you're using, but you use it through us, it's only going to be, it'll be two cents cheaper per serial number. What the hell are we doing, folks? It's like we're selling our souls, right? Those customers are yours. You got to pay attention to this. What are you doing? Here's a question for Tech Data. It, it, if, if the customer or reseller says, oh, tech data, this open MPS thing, oh, this is the greatest thing I've ever seen. I could save two cents a serial number. I got to sign up with you. But, you know, I have a customer that wants to use remanufactured cartridges, you know, from Clover Imaging as an example. So when you're sending them the, the supplies, are you going to send them remanufactured cartridges or are you only going to send them OEM cartridges? That would be a question I'd be asking of tech data. I mean, I could see the, can you imagine tech data? Think about it. You know? The senior leaders at Tech Data, sitting in a coffee shop with Eureka Loris at HP, and they're sitting around there talking, and Tech Data says, man, I am a giant distributor. You know, you got the largest footprint of printers out there. We need to work together to get resellers to give us data. We could control the whole print world if we could just work together to get resellers to sacrifice their customers. Because, you know, like, we'll come out with a DCA tool, and we'll tell the resellers they're going to save a couple cents per serial number. You know, you got that Amplify agreement between the two of us. We're collecting all of this data. We'll be able to drive business to those end users any way we want one day. And in the meantime, we'll just fool everybody. It's all about toner replenishment. Crazy stuff. But maybe we should really start digging into this a little bit deeper and try to figure out what all this means. And the question remains, why in the world is a reseller giving away customer information to huge corporations simply so that the customers could get toner? Really? I would think if you're in our industry, that industry that sells supplies and services print equipment, you've figured out how to get customers toner a hell of a long time ago. What benefit are you really getting? What are you giving up to give away the data? What are you giving up to give away the data? That's the question. 
You know, this isn't a beat up to tech data. This isn't a beat up to HP. Well, HP, I mean, you know, they apply thing. Everybody hates that. But, but to see tech data coming in here now with this open MPS, I just don't see any benefit for any reseller to allow the largest disty in the world to have access to customer information. Maybe it's just me. Maybe resellers have truly lost their mind. Anyway, just some things to think about because we all know this. Status quo is the killer of all that will be invented. Don't get stuck in status quo and I'll see everyone tomorrow.